Hi folks, this is Jay, hope you're okay today, it's good to see you. I just want to just share a little thought because it, I find it very disturbing really. And, and that is the sort of delusional mentality between the atheist on YouTube at the present time. Um, it's important to be self-aware, it's important to be able to critique yourself and to be able to analyse yourself and to see where your strengths and your weaknesses um, are and unfortunately um, a large proportion of atheists are not able to do that at the present time for whatever reason I do not know but they're unable to critically assess their own position whether they the strengths and the weaknesses and um, n nowhere more can that be seen in terms of coming out of atheism where uh, a large number of videos have been made and a number of disasters have been recorded concerning the atheist uh, and the sort of bluffing and delusion that the atheists are going through and the denial that the atheists are in concerning their position they really do believe that they're winning on YouTube which is a complete joke it's a real joke and um, there's no substance to this whatsoever and I think you've got to be honest ladies I've got to, I think you've got to start being critically aware the fact that you've been completely smashed and destroyed on YouTube and it's very disturbing that you don't seem to realize this or you keep uh, going on pretending that everything's okay and everything's not okay okay it's not a question of of has atheism lost the battle on YouTube the fact is that atheism has lost the battle on YouTube and you keep losing the battles you keep consistently losing the battles and it's time now atheist that you admit this and I just find it very very disturbing very disturbing indeed that atheists will not be honest about this and be critically aware of their own failings I'll give you some examples where I smashed atheism Mithraism that was something you mentioned quite a lot and it was smashed quite easily freedom of the will you were completely routed on that you never even made any real challenge against me and you were in a complete disarray and when you're in disarray what do you do atheist you kind of all disappear and then come back a month later and that's what you did on the freedom of the will you just all disappeared the only person who made a video about it was no plum 99 but it wasn't arguing against me it was just asking for clarification everybody else just ran they just disappeared one person I think making an explicit said he knew what he was talking about but actually he didn't know what he was talking about on the freedom of the will you just ran and on the issue of academic debates you have never ever yet never ever yet sat down and organized a proper academic debate with a debate with some of your best people uh, for me to debate you've never done that all you've done is bluster sabotage me um, do all sorts of uh, funny attacks against me well when people do that kind of thing that that shows a uh, weakness <laughs> not strength when you lose you spin when I make videos you spin you edit the videos you spin the videos I can't count how many times you atheists have taken some of my videos out of context and said haha Jason said that and I haven't <laughs> it's been completely taken out of context we consistently have provided uh, on this channel and on on Dream 100 tons of resources of research material that you can go and look at on this channel alone there's a bit, at least two three hundred articles that you can always go to, uh, to study and read sometimes I put things that uh, that are against my position 
that's something that you YouTube atheist out there, even your best, very, very, very rarely do. Atheist, come on, be honest. Stop walking in total delusion. You're walking in total delusion. Be open to to investigate. Be open minded. That's all I'm asking. But please stop walking around in utter delusion. Oh, Aaron Ra has beat Thunderfoot. Uh, Aaron Ra has beat um, Ray Comfort. Aaron Ra has beat Ray Comfort or or um, Hovind has been beat or whatever. Listen. Your arguments get destroyed every day, atheist. It's the easiest thing in the world to debunk atheism. It's the easiest thing in the world to stand up for the Christian faith. And to walk around as if you have won the YouTube battle, you're deluded. You're totally deluded. Okay? So come on, atheist. Get your academic debates up and running. Let's get moving. Come on, Aaron, right? Get sorted, lad. Get an academic debate organised. But don't be claiming victory on YouTube when you haven't won the victory. You haven't. E we haven't even begun. We haven't e be even begun. Be started. Okay. So stop walking around with your little smug faces thinking you've won on YouTube. You haven't won. You haven't even begun to win. In fact, you've lost. You've lost the key arguments. You have lost them. You have lost them. Okay? People might be making comments uh, underneath my videos. Half of those comments that they make are so easy to debunk. And I'll be debunking some next week. But atheists, come on. It's just getting beyond a joke. It's beyond a joke, atheist. It's beyond a joke. You're losing every time. You're getting destroyed every time. And you have the cheek to go around thinking that you're winning. You ain't winning, atheist. You can't be winning when you get smashed. You have to spin against someone. You can't be winning if you're not willing to have academic debates. You can't be winning if you don't provide articles for people to go and research. You can't be winning when you try to sabotage people. When you try to manipulate people who are your opponents. Rather than have fair, open academic debates. You ain't winning if you're doing that kind of thing. You aren't winning when you're in denial. When you get... When someone actually makes it clear that one of your... Or a couple of your dear arguments are smashed. And you're in denial about it. I don't find atheism a challenge. I really don't find it a challenge, atheist. And it's no good walking around in your delusions. It's no good. I don't find it a challenge... And Christians don't find your atheism a challenge. We, we don't see it as a challenge. And to be honest, many people in the world don't see your atheism as a challenge. They don't see it. If they saw it, well, the world would be atheist. And the world isn't atheist. Most of the world is theist. So obviously you're not winning the argument. You discredited atheist. You're discredited. Until you start to have academic debates, you're discredited. It's as simple as that. And I'm waiting. I've been waiting for two years. Two years, I've been waiting for an academic debate. All I get is they jump you, they outnumber you, they jump you, they manipulate you, they spin against you. They play games with you, they pretend to be your friends, they stab you in the back. What you don't get with these atheists on YouTube is just honest, open, academic debate. You've been challenged thousands of times on this atheist. 
I even ch challenged Aaron Rod today. And it's getting boring, it's getting pathetic, and you cannot, you cannot in all honesty walk around with a straight face on YouTube and say that you have won the battle on YouTube. Because you haven't. You really, really haven't. I'm sorry to say you haven't. So come on. Be honest. And stop. Stop. Well. Stop demeaning yourself. You know, you are demeaning your own ability. You're demeaning your own position. By this kind of crass, pathetic way of conducting yourself. And I'm on about hitch slap. And I'm on about live life. And I'm on about bionic dance. And I'm on about all of the atheists out there who are pumping their YouTube channels. It's a joke. Alright? You're a joke. If you can't get involved in academic debate, what is the point? All you're doing is propaganda. All you're doing is propaganda. That's all you're doing. All you're doing is setting straw men up. And they can all clap. The sea lions can clap at your little games. But at the end of the day, there's no real substance to it. So keep playing your little propaganda games, YouTube atheist. But just remember, because you won't have academic debates, you're discredited. Totally discredited. Because you've got nothing really to back it up with. You're not interested in open, logical argumentation and discussion based on reason and evidence. If you would, you'd have academic debates, but you will not. And so therefore, all you're interested in is straw manning, uh, straw manning and academic... Well, not academic, but puerile nonsense. We on the other hand will continue to maintain high standards of academic integrity where we will provide always or as much as I can resources where people can go and research and think these things through. Okay? And I will always maintain my academic credibility for I've always offered Aaron Ra and people like him the opportunity for academic debate and the offer is there. But sadly, the atheist community will not take up this opportunity and this channel whether you like it or not atheist is becoming and will become the major channel in opposition to atheism on YouTube so you're gonna have to start dealing with me whether you like it or not alright it's got the largest repository of anti-atheist material on YouTube there's over a thousand two hundred videos most of them critiquing atheism or aimed at atheist so you cannot ignore the channel. Continually ignoring the channel is showing you showing that you are not willing to engage in proper academic discourse and it's as simple as that. And it's because you deny the truth and you do not want to know the truth that you stay away from academic debate on this channel. And you cannot in all integrity as all you can be is hypocrites if you say well Jay you're not up to the standard I'm not up to the standard when Hitch Slap puts a video of mine up which he edits out of four hours of discussion takes ten minutes and edits it on his channel against me and making explicit and at the same time the next video after that and the next video he uploads Magic Sandwich Show with Richard Dawkins in it and Thunderfoot if I'm no good, if I'm rubbish, if I'm, I'm not important in any way, shape or form, which I, I don't think I am, but if I'm, if I'm so bad, why take a, a piece of my video and edit it out of four hours to ten minutes so that it can make atheism look good? And then why put the Magic Sandwich Show after me next? It's hypocritical. They just don't want to fight fair, they don't want to have proper academic debates, they just want to manipulate things, play propaganda, and it's as simple as that. As far as I'm concerned, you've lost atheist, you have no integrity, you're not honest, you're not open, you don't want to have proper academic debates, and I'm sick and tired of the propaganda games that you keep playing. Simple as, okay? That's my thinking. Totally confident what I'm saying, 
and I don't care what you say. I